Yo, what's up, everybody? Warlock here. Welcome back to the channel, guys. Today, we're going to be checking out Apex Legends Season 5 Fortune Favors gameplay trailer. Let's get right into it. All right, everybody, welcome back. Today, we're checking out Apex Legends Season 5 Fortune Favors gameplay trailer. Now, I know a lot has been happening over this last week leading up to Season 5. We had Loba's backstory with the, you know, the, the Storylands or the Wildlands, whatever you want to call it. We had the backstory there, and then we got her exclusive trailer just a few days ago, and now we got the gameplay trailer. We're going to check this thing out, and then we're going to talk about it. I hope you guys enjoy it, so let's get right into the action. Ooh, Loba, you th oh, did she kill Revenant? What? No way. Well, I guess this party is going to last a bit longer than I had hoped. Skull Town's destroyed, dude. Has begun. So that did happen from the last trailer. Holy crap, dude treasure to my collection just be careful and don't die here we go again no way what you get treasure pack now oh my god look Oh, she's building something. You want advice? Oh, that Wee Man skin is so sweet. The rebuild of Skull Town, dude. Did that just give an ultimate? Oh, dude. Dude, I got goosebumps, bro. I literally got goosebumps right now. Holy crap, dude. God dang it, respawn. Just when I took a step back, you reel me back in. God dang it. Ladies and gentlemen, season five fortune favors gameplay trailer coming May 12th. Season five drops. I cannot wait. Oh my God, dude. Okay. Let's go back. Loba looking dick. Looking dick. All right, so check it out. Skull Town completely destroyed. We got a nice little teaser of this in the last trailer after Loba emerged from Revenant's place being destroyed, which was actually under Skull Town. So Skull Town gone. Okay, it looks like they're building. And it seems to be higher than where Skull Town used to be. So it's like everything was leveled up. So that's nice. Skull Town, that's gone. That really sucks. But the new build, right? Let's skip through. Nighttime. Valuable treasure. So now you get to work towards something. This is that mission goal that they talked about. So you start your quest line. That's what it is. We're going to freeze frame it on the... Uh, so new quest available. Mission one. So you can get the broken ghost. So I'm, I'm assuming they're going to have multiple quests that you can do for this, which would be really sweet. You can get clues, which look like come out of the uh, loot crates, which involve the treasure pack, which is really, really nice. Like, that's really cool. The treasure pack is pretty sick. And survive the hunt. So objective, find the hidden uh, artifacts. So it looks like there's going to be monsters that can help protect. So you got a time limit. So that seems pretty cool. Like if you start the objective, so this is all going to be taking place while you're competing with the other players actually in the BR. It's not going to be separate. At least I don't think it's going to be. Look at that. They had an, oh, did you see that? Did you see the freaking minigun, dude? Is that a minigun? Oh, no, no. You're just protecting it while it's drilling. Okay. And then escape. And see, this is nutty. Look, look at all the pieces. She's, oh, I, you, you know what she's building? I bet you she's building some kind of armor. Something to fight Revenant with. That's what it looks like. Or it's a weapon. 
or it's a weapon but this is where things get nice i like the gold i like that this wingman skin ladies and gentlemen if you weren't a fan of the wingman i suggest when season five comes out you get this skin and you just tear it up because this skin is nasty the new skull town this is cool man this is going to change how it works so here's then the, my next question is in season five are we done with world's edge we're gonna come back to, to broken king's canyon you know is that what we're gonna be playing on fingers crossed respawn i hope so i certainly hope so this is interesting so you can hit these pillars and it gave him his ultimate right away you want to talk about a nice little twist that's really cool and then of course loba please again respawn this right here i hope this is her heirloom i know she's about to drop her ultimate but i hope the staff is her heirloom so let's see it made oh it made some kind of it made like an aoe it made an aoe and she got some kind of gun out of it so it could give you something random which is an interesting twist but this right here dude the teleportation tactical oh my god dude this is gonna tear it up that's gonna be nutty man you should smile more. oh loba you dirty dirty woman Whew. wow gosh guys season five is insane so recap we got broken skull town on king's canyon new map all broken i wonder what other changes are going to happen loba's coming her tactical and ultimate ability is literally going to be changing it. I tell, i'm telling you guys when she's going to give wraith a run for her money she's gonna i think she's going to have a hitbox just as small her tactical might end up being one of the best in the game her ultimate seems okay. I don't know. From what we saw, it seemed like an AOE effect, and then she can reach in and get some kind of random item, maybe a gun or a healing item, something like that. That seems really cool. The new quests, I'm kind of excited to see. Those are something new, something that's changing to Apex Legends. I think you know, but what's going to be the payoff? We really didn't get to see that, unless it's like just in-game cosmetics and stuff. Like how how like is it going to be worth doing in-game a month's you know, fighting all these other people, right? You know, I, I feel like it's going to be really cool, you know, or or when you start a quest, does it take you out of the BR and you go do the quest and then you can come back? I doubt it. I think it'll all be in the same thing. So that way, like another team could jump you on doing the same quest and complete it, you know, etc. cetera. So I'm, I'm curious to see how that's going to work. The new battle pass, I hope there's some good skins in there. It looks like they got some more of this whole gold theme going on. This kind of like jewelry kind of like, theme that's happening it looks cool i hope uh, i hope the rest of the battle pass turns out real nice but uh overall man i'm very excited for season five guys i can't wait to get started playing may 12th guys which is in what in a few days it's in four days season season five starts i can't wait to start pumping out some more apex legend videos for you guys so if you have enjoyed them drop that like button okay guys if you are new to this channel hit that subscribe button turn on post notification bell so you guys don't miss out on more videos like this and as for me warlug as always guys stay gaming i'll see you in the next one peace